everybody, welcome back to SexyKnitter.com. Today I'm continuing my review of TNNA and I want to show you some yarns that I got from Barocco. I had so much fun visiting the Barocco booth and that visit really made my whole trip because um, my friend Grace Akram introduced me to Nora Gon and Nora Gon already knew who I was! So that just like made my whole trip. I could not believe she knew who I was and that was um, pretty cool, because Nora Gon is a rock star, so uh, that was pretty awesome for me. Anyway, she gave me a tour of the booth and talked to me about um, independent designers working with Barocco, and apparently they love working with independent designers, and she gave me some yarn, so I want to show you what she gave me. Um, first up is Remix, and this is a really awesome sort of like tweed yarn. It's super soft. It's made out of 100% recycled fibers, and it's 30% nylon, 27% cotton, 24% acrylic, 10% silk, and 9% linen. So it's a lot. It's like a really great mixture of all different um, types of fibers, but it's really soft. It has a great twist to it, and it's just got this like wonderful flex of color in there. I think that would make a great sweater or even a skirt or a sweater dress would be really cool out of that. Um, looking forward to swatching with that. Um, then another set of yarns that she gave me is called Maya. These are chain construction yarns, which I always love, and they're kind of a little bit hard to find. You don't see chain construction yarns very often. What chain construction yarn is is basically a knitted tube that you knit with. So I think that's really cool. Um, um, it kind of has like this real lofty texture um, when you knit with it. And of course because it's a tube it's gonna um, have really great insulative properties to it when you knit with it. This is made out of 85% cotton and 15% alpaca. And again it's called Maya. This is new for them I do believe. And oh, such amazing colors too, right? That mustard and the gray. I'm really excited to do something with this. Uh, that is going to be great. And I'm just really pleased to see them introduce this. This has great yardage too. This is 137 yards per skein. Um, something else that's new for Broco, you know that the weekend yarn that they produce has been very popular. They have it in two weights already, and they are introducing a third weight, which is weekend DK. This is 75% acrylic, 25% cotton. It feels amazing. It does not feel like, you know, acrylic that people love to hate on. This feels really nice, and it, it mostly just feels like cotton. It has a great sheen to it. Um, it looks like, to me, a two, no, it's like a, more like a four ply, maybe. Really tight twists on each one of those plies, so this is going to be great for um, cables or stitch patterns where you need really great definition and again the yardage is amazing 268 yards in this skein and the retail prices for these yarns are super low I mean they're like I think the Maya is like $6.50 a skein and the Weekend DK is like $8 a skein so super affordable definitely within the budget to create a whole project out of even if you're on a very strict budget like I am. <laughs> um, so definitely something to keep an eye out for at your local yarn store and if you don't see it at your local yarn store tell them that you're interested in seeing these yarns and having them stock these yarns because most likely they're already carrying something from Barocco so it would be very easy for them to pick up these new yarn lines as well. Another um, yarn that I picked up, and I'm super excited about this, I met this man named Richard. Richard, I'm sorry, I don't know how to pronounce your last name. It's D-E-V-R-I-E-Z-E, -E -E, and I'm sure if I tried it, I would just butcher it, so I'm just going to call you Richard. Anyway, Richard gave me these two skeins of yarn. I am going to be designing a pair of socks out of this, this yarn a little bit later on this year. So keep an eye out for that. I love these colors. It's like beautiful purple and blue with a little bit of pink and yellow and green. It's really wonderful. I don't work with variegateds a lot, but I do like working with variegateds, and these are going to make great, great socks. Now I will tell you a little secret. Richard gave me these two skeins to design with, but he also gave me these two skeins to give away. So when that sock pattern does come out a little bit later on this year, probably in August, we're going to be doing a giveaway. So you'll be able to win two skeins of yarn from Richard and the pattern. So stay tuned. 
Um, that's it for today. I do have more yarn to show you a little bit later on, so stay tuned, stick around, and I hope that I'll see you again. Bye!